Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. Today is gonna be a study with me because it's Sunday and I have a bunch of stuff that I need to get done before starting the new week. I just got back from Tampa last night and it was so much fun, but of course I neglected some of my schoolwork while I was there and so now I'm kind of trying to play catch up. I just wanna get ahead again. So I thought I would do a study with me video and kind of show you guys how I'm gonna get a bunch of tasks done in a minimal amount of time. I just made a hot cup of coffee because I can't study without my coffee. It's already put one sugar in the raw in my coffee and then I just like to add some of this organic half and half. Sometimes I use the French vanilla creamer from like Coffee Mate but I'm just making this one with regular. I'm gonna go ahead and light my volcano candle. I'll link this one for you guys. It's honestly just such a nice scent while you're studying. I literally burn this all the time and there's still so much left. Lately, I have been really liking chill lo-fi study beats, so that's the music I'm gonna listen to while I'm doing this. I've shared this tip with you guys before, but in case you're new here, I like to use sticky notes to write down my tasks so that way I can just peel the sticky note off as I complete tasks and I can visually see like how much I'm accomplishing. So it kind of motivates me to keep going. So I'm just gonna start out by writing down everything that I need to get done. So I have a mastering chemistry reading assignment I have to do. And that's for chapters 3.5 through 3.6. And that's actually due tonight at 11.59. Then I have my unit one exam reflection. I have the pre-class assignment for tomorrow which is on quantized energy and photons. I'm gonna pretend I know what that means. I have assignment number three for genetics, which is based on chapter three. And last but not least, I have to do the pedigree problems for genetics. So I just put the sticky notes right here so they're just kind of right in front of me as I'm working and I'm going to start my music and we're going to start with this reading assignment right here. Oh yeah, and I almost forgot, I'm going to be using the Forest app. I forgot to tell you guys that I've been using this again. Um, it's really great. You basically can study for set amounts of time and then you can plant trees as you go. It's to help you with getting distracted from your phone. So I really like using this to break up tasks. I'm actually going to do 30 minutes and once I reach 600 coins, I'll be able to unlock another tree again. I've only unlocked one so far, but it was like a Halloween one back in November of last semester. So I'm still trying to work on unlocking another one. So let's do this. So I just finished watching the videos that go along with this chapter and just taking some basic notes. So now I'm gonna go ahead and do the assignment online. So I just finished the Mastering Chemistry reading assignment so I can pull that off. What a satisfying feeling. Throw this in the garbage. And now we're gonna do the unit one exam reflection and then we'll move on to the next thing. I got my 10 coins from the forest app and then you guys can see if you're not familiar with this app, you can go and look at your forest and it'll tell you just how much you studied that month. So I've only planted one tree. I actually haven't been using this app too much lately, but it's really good when you have a lot of things to do at one sitting so that way you don't get distracted. So there's that. I'm gonna go ahead and start again. I already took a small break, but if you want, you can actually set a five minute break right within the app so that way it'll notify you when you need to come back. But I'm gonna start again and do my unit one exam reflection, but I'm gonna do 25 minutes. So 
I just finished the unit one exam reflection and now I'm about to start I think one of my genetics assignments because I already did two chemistry assignments so I also have my pre-class assignment on quantized energy and photons but I'm gonna wait on that one um, I still have to do it today but I just want to switch it up a little bit so I'm gonna do the pedigree problems for genetics so I actually have to print off these practice problems it looks like and then we submit them in a Dropbox I have no idea what I'm doing when it comes to this I guess we're gonna be Working with pedigrees and like recessive and dominant traits and all that good stuff, which I very vaguely remember from high school that was so long ago. So we'll see how this goes. I'm gonna go ahead and print this and I filled up some water so we can keep powering through. So I printed the pedigree problems worksheet that we have to do and this has like several problems. I'm like very unfamiliar with what any of this means so I'm watching the videos. I've actually already read the chapter over the weekend so I'm just gonna be watching through these videos which are kind of long and then afterwards I'll start working on the worksheet. I printed off the pedigree worksheet and now I'm just watching the videos that are a part of this module because this is an online class so lots of videos for how you learn things and then I'm just following along with our book because a lot of of the things that they're talking about in the videos go along with what we're learning in our book and my forest app just notified me that my tree just finished and I now reached 600 so I was going to show you guys how you can buy a new tree on here because it's really cool so you just click this and you can see back in Halloween I was telling you guys I bought that one don't mind my atrocious nail the nail polish came off and I need to go get them redone because I literally just got this manicure yeah so you can pick a new tree to plant and oh so let's see Ooh. I really, really like this star one. I have wanted this one for a while, so maybe we'll do the star one. So you click unlock and, oh wow, this is new. So now you can unlock different versions of flowers based on the time. Okay, wow, I haven't been on this app in a while. They're always changing things. Let's do the starry tree because it looks, oh my gosh, you need 2,000 for that. Okay, never mind. We can't afford that. I guess we could do this one. What is this? You used to be able to just buy a tree. Okay, they really upped the cost. Oh, I can grow a watermelon. We're gonna grow a watermelon because that's all we can afford. Here we go. So we'll do 25 minutes. I'm gonna watch the video and then I'm gonna start working on the worksheet. Okay, so a little update for you guys. I am about halfway through this genetics pedigree paper, but I'm starting to get stuck on some of these because it started out where all of them were autosomal dominant, which is like the easier one to identify, but now some of these are getting into sex-linked inheritance, and basically we have to identify the genotypes based on the pedigree which is probably really easy, but some of these are confusing me. And so I'm waiting until my sister is free a little bit later to keep working on that because she already took genetics. So she can kind of help me with that. So I'm moving back into chemistry and I'm gonna do the pre-class assignment for tomorrow, um, which is the energy and photons. So let's do this. So I just finished my pre-class assignment. So that leaves pedigree problems and my genetics assignment. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the genetics assignment. I told you guys I'm doing the pedigree problems later tonight with my sister. I also wanted to mention this water cup because I always get asked about this cup whenever I show it in like an Instagram post or something. It's from Amazon, it's like 13 bucks and it is glass with like a silicone sleeve. I love it so much. So for this genetics assignment, it's basically five questions for an online assignment and I'm just going to go to my genetics book and I have the ebook right here on good notes so I'm just gonna go through and search what the questions are asking so I can find it easily in my ebook and answer the questions they're all like short response so it'll take me a little bit but yeah let's do this
Okay guys, and several hours later, I just finished with my genetics assignment. I'm not doing the pedigree thing until later, so I am gonna go ahead and end this video so that I can start editing and hopefully get it uploaded for you guys tonight. I really hope that you guys enjoyed studying with me. I love doing these videos and I love hearing from you guys about how it motivates you to keep going in school. So good luck, I hope you guys have an awesome week this week and stay tuned to my Instagram if you're not already. Love posting stuff on there about what I'm doing throughout the week and obviously I'll be vlogging and stuff this week. So if you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video.